Today we are going to be playing around and making some of your own decorations just out of generic things that you can buy at home improvement stores and etc. To start, um, the main ingredient to these decorations is going to be the Great Stuff Pond and Stone. This stuff is different from the regular Great Stuff. Um, it is the color black and kind of looks like a dark stone-like material and it is aquarium safe. There's a link in the description box from Amazon. It's the cheapest place I've found to buy it. Um, if you're a Prime member, it ships to your house in two days. It's around nine or ten dollars, but it's completely worth it because you can just do tons of cool stuff on your own. But as far as what I'm using to make some of my own stuff, is some terracotta pots I broke up so that they sit uh, flat on the bottom of your tank. There is a plastic fake wicker basket. There's another kind of basket over there. These are some 90 degree kind of like turns that you get at your home improvement store in the gutter section. I have no idea what they're used for. Um, something as far as concrete or gutter systems, etc. And some of this stuff is plastic and may float, and especially when you integrate a foam with all this stuff, it may float. So that's where the stones come in. I decided to use lava rock because it's extremely porous and inhibits the growth of beneficial bacteria. A bag of this stuff will run you about eight bucks. It's truly great in all aquariums. I absolutely love it, and I'll be adding it to the decorations as I go to kind of add some weight, and also to kind of imitate that stone-like, you know, feel to them, to the products. So, without further ado, I'm gonna get the camera and set it on a tripod and just start dabbling. I highly advise you wear gloves with this great stuff because it does not come off your skin. It is by far the worst thing I have ever had on my skin in ages. I highly advise to wear gloves. So, all right guys, let's get started. And no laughing either because this is just pure creativity and I love making my own decor. So no laughing unless you are going to beat me with your creativity, that's the rule. So, all right, let's get started. Kind of got to use your hands so that it doesn't bubble too much. I found it get, this is going to get extremely messy, so you got to remember to use gloves.
And you may be wondering how I'm gonna cut it away from the piece of wood that it's on. I'm probably just gonna use like a big uh, razor knife, the ones that extend out and etc. Again, there's no perfect way. Yes, this may look somewhat amateurish, but you can always spray it with Krillon, black paint after, or just kind of do whatever you want. I can't get into this stuff, so it's a hobby. There's that one. That one's pretty much done. This foam expands more than you think, so I just want to try to get all the parts that are covered. Get this block over there. It's kind of taken away from the opening. Okay, so there's that. I don't know. Looks okay. Let's do. Uh, I don't know. I kind of like that. It is pretty dang cool. I think I'm gonna do some rocks to the back of it so it doesn't have a tendency to flip up. Almost like a, a base to it. Yeah, I think that would be okay. Okay. Now let's attempt this thing. I'm not into. I'm only into like natural looking uh, decor. So this just really just doesn't do it for me. I have no idea what I'm doing, but I've had this thing for years. Try to give it a new look, so I say. Maybe I'm getting it over my head here, but I think I'm getting it over my head. I'm never gonna look different unless I sit here. No matter what, it's gonna look like a coliseum. cooler than a terracotta pot and all that inside the tank. Okay. Woo! This stuff is sticky. You gotta remember this stuff's going to expand a little. So it'll look cooler than what it looks like right now. But I want that like foam like look that this is starting to do already. So you kinda gotta like mess with it a little. Let's throw some rocks in there. Just to show you guys, you can uh, mess around with whatever you want. This thing looks okay. This is as long as it doesn't get that foam like look. Destined to make this Coliseum look like something different. You know that? I'm destined. Let's see this. Let's do another one of these.
this one. This one broke, broke all the way through, and the fisher bales swim all the way through, especially big fish. Here's a closer look to what some of this stuff looks like. The pots look cool. Um, those things look okay, I don't know. Coliseum looks like crap. Not sure what I was thinking. Uh, but yeah, it's kind of a, uh, just whatever you make it. I've made a lot of like cichlid stones. Um, it's kind of nerve wracking because you never know how any of it's going to turn out because it's it's a mess and you just gotta wing it so let me know what you guys think give it a thumbs up if you like thumbs down if you don't i guess uh i'll be okay with the honesty all right